right. So everyone marveled about the iPad Mini when it came out because it allowed, it was smart enough to know whether or not your thumb was on it versus your finger so there wasn't accidental detection. But certainly one of the big trends in tablets is having small, is smaller and smaller bezels. So you have thinner and sleeker designs. But Synapse is taking a different approach to this problem with their sense of concept tablet device. So can you just tell us how what makes it different? Sure, absolutely. So what we did um, is add two multi-touch sensors, one on the left side and one on the right side, right. Uh, to the back of this concept tablet that we call Sensa. Right. And what that allows you to do is actually image mm -hmm. the back um, touches. Right. And once you know where the back touches are, you can actually define uh, regions of interest so that when your thumb actually touches down, right. it appears as a grip event as shown by this big rectangle there. Right. Meanwhile, you know, your primary touches um, you know, that are coming from the right side will function as you would expect instead of having the thumb you know, be um, interpreted as a primary touch. Right, so using a combination of the multi-touch sensors on the back and the front, it basically knows the difference between a grip and poking at the screen or wanting to swipe or something like that. That is correct. Yeah, so a combination of mm -hmm. you know, adding some new hardware to the tablet, uh -huh. but also extending uh, the Android kernel to mm -hmm. uh, propagate a new kind of touch event called grip data okay. uh, is what we end up uh, doing for the Sensa tablet. So what grip data could, could apply to, and you guys created your own ebook reader to show people what this is like and, and how it would work in the real world. That is correct. So in an ebook reader setting, you know, obviously you don't want any, um, you know, um, fingers to obscure your text. So you can right. take the grip data and actually um, move the margin over. So we call this thing uh, dynamic margin control. Uh -huh. And we've got a different, uh, couple different examples of how that happens. This is kind of a fixed margin. Right. But more importantly, when you scroll to the next page, um, the dynamic margin control functions as you would expect. Right. This one just is a pure, you know, follow your grip um, thumb. You know, can, but the control. text can also wrap around your thumb, should you? Yes, exactly. That, yeah. Let me see if I can get into that. Sorry. Okay. So this one is a. Um, uh -huh. Oh, that's pretty neat. Yeah, a bounding box. Mm -hmm. And then finally, let me see if I can get oops, into that. And this is the wrap around version. Oh, that's neat. Yeah. So with this new grip detection, right? Yes. Uh, and not just suppression, right? We're, we're talking about a whole new way to interact with tablets, and you guys are going to potentially expand this into things like gaming, right? Right, absolutely. Mm -hmm. You know, there's a lot of potential, you mm -hmm. know, for the back sensor to be used for additional uh, navigation capabilities as right. well as shortcuts. Mm -hmm. And then furthermore, I mean, this is, you know, what we use to get the conversation started, you know, with our OEM customers right. um, and, you know, provide some game-changing functionality that, um, you know, Synaptics technology is capable of doing beyond, you know, just the touchscreen, um, you know, functionality that, you know, we introduced um, about five to ten years ago. So when should consumers expect to see Sensa-like tablets hitting the market? Oh, that's a good question because, you know, the trend is already starting. I mean, uh -huh. you saw, um, you know, rudimentary forms of grip suppression right. already available in the iPad mini. Right. So, you know, with the design aesthetic moving towards thinner borders, just like, um, mm -hmm. you know, things are in the handset world, I think that um, it's, you know, probably within the next year or so that you'll start seeing very aggressive, um, you know, grip uh, mm -hmm. sensing capabilities being offered, you know, in tablets. All right, well, thank you very much. We look forward to seeing technologies like this hit the market. This is Mark Spoonauer, Laptop Magazine at CES 2013 with the first look at the Synaptics Concept tablet device, the Sensa.